One American News is calling out the mainstream media for not stating the obvious on election night by declaring Florida for President Trump when the numbers were clear. Take a look. There's no way this is going any other way. I, I think say, we can call Florida for Trump. I just want I, to I'm ready too. to put those 29 over there. Can we can we do that in the back? I don't believe we have called Florida yet. No. Nope. Florida is 89% reporting and he's up 250. So again, I'll say this as we go to break. He's got Florida. Florida is a land of alligators when it comes to calling races. So we're just not quite there yet. Again, they, they have not been willing to put Florida in the Trump column. I don't know why. I still think it's going that way. There's enough precincts in. We've got uh, states all across the bottom of your screen right now that are too early to call, all of which are very important states in this. Virginia could flip, and Florida is in Trump category. Hopefully, when we come back from this two-minute break, uh, we'll call Florida. <laughs> Florida. Take a look there. 91% of the precincts in. Donald Trump, 51.3% to 47.8%. Again, all of those too early to call at this hour. Yeah, I'm a broken record. Florida is going to be Trump. NBC News now says it is too close to call in the state of Florida. 92% of all precincts reporting. Uh, but as always, Eamon, too close. 380,000 votes at 94%. I'm not sure why the AP or nobody else is putting Florida in the I Trump mean, this is bracket. Huge. Yeah. Right. That is over. He has got Florida. Those 29 should be going to President Trump any second. It looks like in Florida, and we can't call anything there yet. Fox News not doing it yet. So let's look at Florida where it's very tight and it hasn't been called yet. I don't know if it's the liberal biased media not wanting to call this over at the AP and the rest of them, but I can't imagine why Fox, CNN, MSNBC, AP, nobody is calling well, Florida for the president. And the fact that the networks haven't called this is just bewildering. Fox and some of these others won't call Florida. Florida. They're literally, if Biden won every vote outstanding, he could not win Florida. This is over, book it, and let's move on. Just putting it out there, since I've been saying it for the last two hours, that Florida is going for President Trump. I'm glad that the governor agrees with me. And you know, while it sure looks like Biden is going to lose Florida, the fact that the Fox News decision team hasn't called Florida yet says to me, it, you know, maybe it's a small margin, but there's still up for grabs. We're at 97% of precincts reporting oh my gosh. President Trump. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> come on, we're going to call Florida. I mean, come on. Yeah. It's over. He is so far ahead. It's done. The powers that be here at OAN have given me the authority. <laughs> we can now officially call Florida for President Donald J. Trump. I only had to fight for the last two hours. I'm like, please. For the love, let me call it. We're going to make a, a big call right here. Uh, the Fox News decision desk can now project that President Donald Trump will win the state of Florida, 29 electoral votes, uh, and he will win, win it convincingly. Absolutely. OAN had called it, now AP and everybody else is officially calling Florida. So I was hoping that we could all get a first over everybody else <laughs> well, and, and call Florida, which we kind of did. You did. Yeah. Want to see more videos like this? Click on the link below and subscribe to One American News on YouTube and call your cable provider and kindly demand that One American News is added to your lineup. Call and subscribe today.